right guys this is actually a sold home uh, from Clayton Homes well, I don't know which number this is but this one actually says sold and as you guys can see you see the brick at the bottom that's the ex that's exactly what I plan on doing with my modular home and this is home number one home number one sold not bad got the bricks leading up to it not a fan of the uh, of the glass but man oh man wow whoa okay all right all right now we talking home number one I, I hear you this wow wow this is this is amazing this is amazing already you got the peppered lights up top you got the ceiling fan as soon as you come in you're greeted with the living room i can get my 84 inch tv up there i know i can <laughs> man listen and blow them speakers away this this is this is amazing this is i'm not really feeling the furniture like but yeah this is amazing man amazing it looks huge in here it looks like a house yes absolutely oh. yeah this this is nice this is nice all right let me get up a little ethernet i see you i see you a little phone Yeah, this is this is definitely nice. Let me tell you something. You can get a longer couch right there. You can get a longer couch right here. You want to do one of those sectionals? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna be honest. I'm not a big fan of sectionals because I feel like it cuts down on the space, man. Instead of you just having a long couch and a long couch, you know what I'm saying? It kind of, yeah. I know it's just. I think that's a man thing. <laughs> Even have you a little little chill space for the uh, the grandparent or whatnot, the chill chill out or whatnot. This this is nice, man. You got the ceiling fan up there. Uh, this would be the dining room area. Probably get maybe a, a slightly longer table. Get about eight people up here. That's nice. It's a nice little touch. Here's this little. It's nice. All right. Woo. We're gonna we're gonna do the kitchen. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do the kitchen first, man. Oh man, this this is this is nice. And this is sold, so um I'm guessing they this is how they got it. Is that a sock? Somebody done left their baby sock in here. Come on, parents. What what, what, what you doing, Terry? Good. So this is another oh I didn't even pay attention to that. It has like a little wraparound porch. Wow. Nice. Nice. We'll go out there uh, in the end. You got two huge windows. This is nice. I, I, I like that. I, um, you know what? This may be number one, man. This, this, this might be number one. Outlets back there, outlets here, outlet there, outlet there, outlet there, outlet there, outlet there, outlet. You see it. You see it. I just wish that the uh, the cabinets went all the way up to the top, but that's not bad, though, man. That's not bad. I don't know. Well, maybe most people aren't going to be tall enough to reach up there. These are some pretty high ceilings. Pretty high ceilings. All right, guys. Here we go. Right here, we got a lot of we got a lot of doors in here. Dishwasher, you got an outlet right here. Outlet on this side. Cabinet space to store everything. Hmm. Wow. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. All right, you got a vent right here. All right, so you can put some bar stools right here if you would like. Another vent on that side. 
refrigerator. Don't want to show too much just yet. But yeah, as you guys can see, this is the kitchen area. That's the kitchen area. This is the kitchen area. All right. Quick view. This is the dining room area. Windows on each side. This is the living room area. Down the hallway is where the rooms and stuff are. I love it. I love it. This is a nice little setup. Had to put it down. I didn't want you guys to feed the price. You probably have, but it's all good. All right. Got a little area right here. More storage. More storage. All right. Got some outlets over here. We got some lights up top. Washer and dryer. Hmm. Wash and dryer hook up right here. Got the back door right here. Hmm. Interesting. We got an outlet over here. Hmm. Yeah, I'm with you. Keep it a band with you. I don't know, man. Like, you can get, I feel like you can really get creative with this little bit of space right here. Like, this right here, you can get creative with this. You can get really, really creative with this if you're nice with it. If you're nice with it. Because technically, this door shouldn't be really opening and closing like that. You know. But yeah, I can get creative with this space right here. All right. Then, wash and dryer hookup. A little space right there. And now let's go on down to the rooms. Stepping into the future, you see it. Stepping into the future, we got some more space over here. A little, maybe a little office. Have your desktop sitting on this side or whatnot. You know, PC, a little monitor, or whatnot. PC on the on the bottom of it all, whatever, whichever you prefer. USB, you see it, you see it. Not bad, not bad at all. All right. Ooh. Well, well, well. This is a nice size room. Definitely prefer car carpet. You guys know how I am with carpet. Maybe a ceiling fan up top. You got your outlets on every wall. You got your vent right here. Big window. Got another outlet back here. Outlet right here. And the inside of the closet. Not too big, but it's a closet. Again, I would definitely much rather prefer a bigger room than a bigger closet. Bigger room, more space. Get down with the get down. Got a vent on the bottom of that door. This is plenty of space. Plenty of space. And again, the higher the ceilings, the bigger the room. It feels like the bigger the room. And they went ahead and went with the, uh, the white as well. You guys know. The light of the room, it makes that it makes that room feel like it's bigger anyway. They know what they're doing. Good job. Good job with this. You also have a smoke detector up there as well. You have another, or you have a full-size bathroom in here. Really, really good size, man. Really, really good size. They did a really, really good job with this. There you go. You can throw some towels and whatnot in there. All right. Not bad, not bad at all. Throw some, see that right there, I don't like. Cover that up. You can have just a little small piece of wood to, you know, cover that cover that spot. Of that. that looks tacky. But, uh, this is nice. Nice little touch. You have a decent size mirror. You can definitely get that mirror a little bit bigger if you would like. You got a light up there. You got a light right here. You got a vent right here. You got a small little window up top and a decent size. Slides in the back before I say anything. Yeah, yeah, this is a really, really decent size tub. I like it. Plenty of space, plenty of room. You can definitely get two people in there easily. You want to take you a, a bath. Definitely a big enough tub to do so. He did a really, really good job with this bathroom. Really, really good job. All 
All right. All right, before we get into the other room, let's get into the, ooh, yes, sir, second bedroom. Talk to me. This is nice. Greeted with a, of course, a switch. You have, make sure there, yep, every wall, you have an outlet. Keep them behind here. I told y'all, I don't like surprises. No. <laughs> All right, we have a smoke detector. We have what could have been a ceiling fan to really seal the deal. This is a decent sized bedroom. Decent sized bedroom. Definitely want to do some carpet in here as well. Really, really decent size. And we have a decent closet. Get some shoes up in here. Uh, pretty this is so this is decent this is decent you can mount your TV on here on one of these walls of course you have a big window right here yeah definitely mount your TV to have a little bit more space in here but yeah not bad not bad decent decent size second bedroom all right and here we go people this right here is the walk in closet just put a little bed in here does have a light in here well all this all that's missing is a little outlet that's all that's missing is an outlet and you know what i'm saying y'all ain't seeing eye to eye i just, just going to the room <laughs> Woo! jeez louise so we have two, not one, but two. You guys see that? Let me walk over here real quick. You got two vents. You have what looks like and appears to be two outlets on every wall. I love it. Absolutely love it. You got two big windows right here. And you guys know how I feel about that peppering. Pepper in that light, man, so it's going to be nice and bright in here. Nice and bright. Yeah. Let me tell you something. You can definitely do some things in here, man. Definitely do some things in this big old room. This is a nice size room. And you also have two little lights up there as well. You know what I mean? Not bad. Not bad at all. Again, it's missing carpet. I definitely prefer carpet. This is huge, man. This is, this is huge. Look at this. Wow. Insane, man. And then, I do love the fact that they had the little barn door. This was open earlier, but they had the little barn door. You just slide this. Wow. And you are greeted with this nice garden tub. Wow. Two huge windows. I'm a private person, man. When I'm naked, I you, Yeah, you can take that out, brother. <laughs> you can take that out. I'm good. I'm good. I, I mean, it's nice, but yeah, you, can take, you, can, you, you can have that. All right. You got a little space right here, a little... His and hers. Yes, sir. Nice. Nice. And you got the outlets right there as well. You got plenty of space. Let's see. Okay, they didn't skimp on that one. They didn't skimp on that one. Cool, cool, cool. All right. And you also have lights. You also have lights all up here. That's going to make sure it's nice and bright in here. Now, you have a private toilet. Private toilet. You got a vent in here. You got a light in here. There you go right there. This is nice. You actually have a door for this as well. You know what I mean? You don't want to be disturbed. Leave me alone. Bam. Also have a vent outside of that. You're going to need it because of... You know, somebody gonna be blowing somebody's nose hairs back. 
And you also have a walk in. This is this is crazy. This is insane. Yo. Yes. Yes, please. I will take that. This is huge, man. Man, you can get up. You can get four people in here. I mean, if that's if that's what you're interested in. That's, yeah. But this is cut on by this right here. Hmm, interesting. It might be better though, from the side instead of yeah, yeah. Probably kind of smart, man. Oh, and it's perfect for people that are that. That's my height, like six feet and over, where you don't have to worry about. But I don't know, man. Maybe. Is this going to be a good thing uh, with this being open like this? I don't know. I don't know. But this, this, this is nice. This is nice. That's what that looks like. Hold on, wait a minute. Before we get into all of that, let me go check the price on this bad boy. This is a very, 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 very nice home. And again, this one is sold, guys. All right, so this is sold, and the price is two hundred and forty-six thousand four hundred and eighty-nine dollars. All right. So this is along with all of the upgrades that this thing got. You guys can kind of see that. Yep. Three bedroom, two bath. 2100 square feet 2176 to be exact southern bale all right southern bale and this ha this home has a lot of upgrades in it a lot of upgrades let me go outside really really quickly one second we have a problem there we go That's what this house looks like. This is this is beautiful. And this is home number one. They did an absolute great job with this home. Absolute great job. I absolutely love the brick on the bottom of it. Apologize for the noise, guys. Absolute great job. With this 2100 square feet home. And I think the fact that uh that they they added that brick just makes it that much more better. It really does not look like a modular home. This was probably, no, this is definitely number one on the list, man. Uh, they definitely did. This, 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 this was nice. This was nice. But I'm going to say this. With the square footage of 2,100 square feet and the price tag of uh, $246,000 I definitely would have did things a little bit different and I probably would have saved some money on the back end when it comes to some of the things like I would absolutely love to see with a uh, with what it looked like before the uh, the add-ons because three bed two bath 2100 square feet that's a that's a lot of square feet for a three bedroom uh two bath house house what do you think JJ? what are your thoughts Price tag that threw it off, or well, definitely the price. Mm -hmm. But I feel like that's because of all the 
like this, all this wood stuff, that wood, the brown wood, mm -hmm. they, they call that an entertainment center. Yeah. Like, I wish they could put the, the original plane price and then the upgrade. Yeah, yeah, that'd be, that'd be dope. Because it's just, this is, yeah. the shower is big, the, the closets are big. Mm -hmm. I still feel like one of the rooms is small. I feel like there's so much space they could have did more. Yeah. Know? Probably it could be. It, I think yeah, carpet definitely to me makes it feel like a little bit more home, homey. You got that carpet in here. It, yeah, it doesn't have that homely feel. Yeah. It's almost like I'm visiting somebody else's house. Yeah. I mean, we are, but. <laughs> it, must, it must be the carpet. Yeah. If maybe it had carpet, it'd be like, wow, okay, I take my shoes off. Yeah, I'm gonna say this. I think uh, Clayton Home what they could do. I think it would be super beneficial. I mean, I don't know if they want to put a tablet or something like this, but have the price of what it looks like without the add-ons, and then the price that it looks like with the add-ons, and maybe have like what what things look like without like anything in inside of it without the the yeah, upgrades. Yeah, 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 like a little video or some or pictures. Yeah, where they can see that and then see what it looks like with the upgrades if you chose to go this route. I think that'll be that'll be dope. Yeah, yeah, something, something like that would, would definitely help. And uh, tell people to stop leaving their kids' socks around here. Come on, brother. Ah, dog, that's a little infant sock, too. It's clean. That's good. But, yeah. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and head to the next one now.